Hi. Now guys, this, you just started Minecraft. What you do is you click the single player button right here. Ignore the other three. Click. Then what you do is you go to create new world. And it'll be called new world for now. You can change the name to whatever you want. You can call it world one my first world or whatever I'll call it that the seed now well just ignore this box right here this box right here that says seed for the world generator ignore it yeah, we're gonna we can talk about that later now click create new world Now Minecraft might be laggy the first time you start playing it. When I first started playing it, the frame rate was one. One frame rate per second. Now what you do is after you spawn, click ask. Now what you do is you go to options. Then you click video settings. Now this this is to make it less laggy. The graphics are in fancy. Um, so, um, um, when they're in fancy, the trees. When they're in fancy, trees will be um, see-through. The, the trees' leaves will be see-through. The clouds will be 3D. And great rain, 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 rainstorms and snowstorms will look cooler. Turn that fat to fast. Now the now the trees. Look, have solid leaves, solid leaves, no see-through, and the, and the and the clouds look flat. Limit frame rate should be on. Um, doesn't really make a difference, but it does. It makes your game less laggy. View bobbing. What it does is this. See how my screen's kind of shaking, like, like I'm walking, right? That's what bobbing does. It's very annoying. Turn off your, your computer will. It'll make your computer less laggy. Make the then then what you do? Turn the advanced OpenGL off. It's supposed to make your screen. It's, it's, uh, it's supposed to make the game run smoother, but it also makes the game lag if you have a slow PC. Now you click ask. Now go to options. Then go to controls. Study these controls. And study these controls. W is forward, S is backwards, A is left, and right is D and D is right. Space is jump. Left shift is sneak. Q is drop. I is inventory. T is chat. F is chog. Now we do press W to go forward. S to go backwards. D to go D to go right. And A to go left. Space bar to jump. Now what you do, and 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 press press left click to break a block. Now when you break a block, you have to break it by. Hey mom, I'm making I'm making a video. I'm making a video. Um. Um. What you do is in order to break a block, you if you you do not rapidly click. You have to hold down the left mouse button, and you'll break it. And to place and and right clicking places the block down. Now, if you have an item in your hand that's not a block, then you won't place it down. Now, what we do is you find a good source of dirt, and you dig into it. Now, keep digging. Now, uh, now what? Now this house is three. Now, yeah, you need a roof. So one. I dug one thing deep. See one. I with the roof and walls. This isn't is is included as part of my house because it has a there's no roof. Things get in there. One, two, three. 
Now, I know the reason why I need to do all this stuff is so you can survive your first night. Because at nighttime, monsters come out of the dark. No, monsters come out and they start spawning and they start killing you. They start like, when I say spawn, I mean like reappear. They start, they like, like appear and they start like, and they want to kill you. And so, yeah, you don't want them to kill you. Monsters don't don't spawn just spawn at nighttime. They also spawn in dark places. But for example, dark places. They spawn in dark places. So now that now that you made your home, you need to find make sure there's trees near your house. If there isn't, then look for then look for them. If 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 try as you might, you can't find trees. Make make it then what you do you press S. And what you do, you press S, save and quit, single player, create new world, create the new world. Ignore. Okay. And you do what I just did. And now what you need, you need five block. No, you need five blocks of wood. Hold down the left mouse button to, to break the wood. And yeah, I got six blocks of I got five. Well, I got six. You need five blocks of wood. Now press press I for inventory. And take this wood by pressing left click. Now a left click picks up the wood. If you press right click, you'll split the wood in half. Split the stack in half. If you if you, if you're having your hand and you press right click and you'll place one of the items in the stack down. If you press left click, it puts the whole stack down. Now what you do is you go right click, you pick, now this converts into that, and left click to pick it up, right click, right click, right click, right click, left click to pick it up, left click to close it down, I to close the inventory, place the coffee table up here, if you place it down here, we're going to place a stove down here, if the crafting table is down here and the stove is up there, the stove will not work. So. Now what you do is you take this, right click, take this, right click, right click, take this, set it aside, take this, right click, take this, put it right there, take this, right click, right click, right click, set it down, right click, right click, put that right there, take this, put it put in your hot bar, which is the thing down here. I to close your inventory. Now what you do is you dig downwards in the stair step matter manner like this. So, so dig down in the stair step matter so you, in the stair step manner so you can get out. You don't want to trap yourself on your first day in Minecraft in bed. First impression of Minecraft. I got trapped. I don't think I want to play Minecraft again. Yeah, you probably won't have want to play Minecraft again if you get trapped the first time. So now when you break stone with a pickaxe, you get cobblestone. If you break with your hands or anything else, you get nothing. You want to break eight blocks of stone. You want to break eight blocks of stone. So you can get eight blocks of cobblestone. So, so you can create a stove. Oops. One block one block of stone. Two blo two blocks of cobblestone. Three blocks of cobblestone. Four blocks of cobblestone. Five blocks of cobblestone. Six blocks of cobblestone. Seven, seven blocks of cobblestone. Eight. Ignore the coal. Because surprisingly, I won't need it. You do not need any coal. No coal needed. Know what you do? Right click your, your crafting box, left click to pick it up, right click, 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 right click. Take this furnace, left click to put, place it down, I to close your inventory, 
Now in order, no, oh yeah, when, in order to toggle through these thingies, you have to press the number keys, one through nine, for each of the boxes, squares. One, this box, press nine, you'll go to this box. Three is where the stove is. Right click to place on the block. Point at the block you want to place on and right click. Right click this thing. All right click and put place on right and now what you want to do is you place only one you place only one block of wood in there. Then what you do? Okay, this music is really annoying me. Yes. Okay, then what you do is you place the wooden place in here. Only place one. Actually, place the place the whole stack. Sorry. Then what you do? It's getting dark already. Right click your crafting bench. Right click your crafting bench. Pick it up. Place it right there. Take the sticks. Place them right there. Left click and you get torches. Now what you do is take the torches, right click, and you'll place it down. Now, if there are monsters, there is no barrier between monsters for getting in your home. So you want what you want to do, right click, take this, close it there, pick this up, one, two, three, four, five, six. Take this whole thing. That's right there. I had to close the inventory. Toggle to five, toggle to a number to get that. And by the way, if it's getting laggy, um, right now you don't really need to look very far. So render distance. But render distance is something that you can. If it's render distance, if it's on far, you'll look very far. But they'll be, but it'll be more laggy because it has to load, it has to load more things to look at. Tiny, you look very closely. You don't need, yeah. Tiny is not really laggy, so turn it tiny because you don't need to look far right now. Now what you do is you right click at the block and place it on. If you play, if you if you look right here and you play, if you right, look right here and you placed it, it it would have been on this edge. You want it on that edge, so so monsters they won't build it because when you're inside. Now you're on this block. It's on that edge. You can punch through the door and add um, different things like that. But outside you can't see. So the mo monsters can, and and other things, nothing can open the door but you. So monsters will be trying to trying to hit you, but, but instead they'll just be hitting the door. And you can hit the monsters, back. and then you can hit the monsters. Yeah, but in order to hit the monsters, you have to walk right up to the door. If you stand back and hit the door, you'll you end up hitting the door instead of what it's outside it. And if you look down to hit this, you punch it through the window. This is probably why you put the window there. So yeah, that's how that's how to survive your first night. And charcoal. Is exactly like coal. The only difference is, it's number one. It's called charcoal. And number two, you obtain it differently. A lot of people think that you need coal to survive your first night. That's not true. Charcoal is is better because well, because it's a because it's a renewable resource. But the reason why it's better is because sometimes you you won't be able to find coal. A lot, sometimes, a lot, actually, a lot of times, happens often, I cannot find coal. I search a lot, and I can't find coal. Because the coal, I just can't find coal. I don't want, so, and you don't want to waste your whole um, day and night in Minecraft searching for coal. Because if you waste your whole day in Minecraft searching for coal, night will come, and monsters will kill you. There, there, there's a lot more trees than there are coal. Okay, well, uh, that's not true. Sorry, there's a lot. Trees are much much easier to find than coal, so that's why charcoal 
So it turns you can use charcoal. So bye and